Hi, I'm Doug Pat, and this is How To Architect. The Fibonacci Sequence, the Golden Rectangle, and Architecture. In 1202, Leonardo Fibonacci was famously investigating rabbit reproduction and made note of a sequence that is now known as his namesake, the Fibonacci Sequence. The sequence is a series of numbers derived by adding each number to the previous, that is, 1 plus 1 equals 2, 1 plus 2 equals 3, 2 plus 3 equals 5, etc. Plant leaves as a spiral around a stem, called phylotaxis, in some cases follow a mathematical rhythm of 1.618. That's the same spiraling numerical rhythm seen on the skin of a pineapple, as well as the seed head arrangement of the sunflower and the base of a pine cone. In geometric terms, if a rectangle is drawn with one side equal to 1, and its perpendicular, represented as 1.618, a desirable shape emerges. In 1876, Gustav Fechner did a study that determined people visually preferred the shape to other rectangles. It's thought that the ratio may have been used as early as the Egyptians in the creation of the Great Pyramids. Based on measurements of the Pyramid at Giza, the hypotenuse almost precisely matches the number phi, or 1.618. It's also thought that Andrea Palladio employed the golden ratio proportions. This is his Villa Rotonda, outside of Vincenza in northern Italy. Even the modern architect Le Corbusier used the proportions in his modular man study and, most likely, in the design of his Unité de Habitation in Marseille, France. If you're looking for more videos about the golden rectangle and architecture, just click the link in the description box. I'm Doug Pat. We'll see you next time.